all the National Plain people were just intently watching. And the Don Bosco kids weren't cheering because Charlie was beating the National Plainfield kid. I think that they were just all in awe of how good of a wrestler he is because he is so good. <laughs> and at the same time, you know, they, there wasn't the little cat calls and there wasn't the little, you know, make him wrestle and all those stuff that I've heard for years and years on end. Because I think that they're just in awe of the true champion that we have. And in awe of how um, good and um, Charlie wrestled in the championships of the district, wrestled in our Moscow case. And during that time, National Plainsfield people were just like, you know, cheering, you know, for Charlie. They were cheering at the end because we won or anything, but they're like, you know, make him wrestle and all the little cat calls and everything like that. Well, He's got respect of everybody in this whole area about wrestling. And I think that really stands out in um, for a young kid like Charlie and how he can represent us and represent Hudson, represent this area down the line and over the next couple of days. And um, I think that not only do we here understand that he's a true champion, but people all across Iowa understand that he's a true champion. So let's give him another round of applause. And my one last thought before I turn the microphone over to Charlie is um, it's it's kind of it's not a good thing up here that he's going to stay in this life. But um, I think what I'm very happy about is that and I think that means a lot to him and a lot to a lot of other people. So here's Charlie.
Good stuff, come on.
sweetheart.